Hello everyone, in this video I am going to explain about PyMol. It is an structure visualization tool to visualize your 3D structure of the protein molecule or any kind of macro molecules. It produces a high quality 3D images of your protein or such kind of a macro molecules. Let's see how the tool is work. And this is the home page of PyMol. In this tool contains there are three windows like the top window is the upper control panel and the bottom window is the command line and the right side window is the object menu panel. It contains the option like show, label, color, active. You can choose any option to alter your structure and the bottom is the movie control panel. Let's see how to install the PyMol software in your system. Now go to browser and type pymol it can accept only the 64 bit windows operating system next you click the free download option and it will show the download page then you click the download option here it can easily download in your system because uh, it is a open source software then you will download your protein structure using pdb so type pdb and click rcsb pdb home page so it will show the pdb home page it contains 150000 entries so you can easily retrieve any kind of protein molecule in the search option you can give any protein and this is the cytochrome p450 enzyme you click that structure and uh, you can click the download option here you can download in your structure in the pdb format so the structure will be automatically downloaded in your system now go to pymol and open your pdb structure uh, which protein uh, you can downloaded Click that protein and open in your PyMol software. And this is the cytochrome P450 enzyme which is the family of enzymes containing heme as a cofactor that function as a monooxygenase. Then in the object menu panel click the active and give the orient. So the structure will arrange properly. Then you can click the show option. It will show the many models like ribbon, sticks, cartoons. You can use which model you want like a ribbon or a sticks. Uh, you click the sticks model. Uh, it will show the sticks. So this structure mixed ribbon, sticks and cartoon models. I prefer to use the cartoon model. So you will give the command of hide everything comma all. So the structure will be hided. Then you can give the command of show cartoon all. So the structure only displayed in a cartoon model. And this structure contains the secondary structure like helix, turns, loops, coils etc. I will prefer to differentiate the secondary structures using the different colors like purple, yellow, green. In compared to tertiary structure, the secondary structure is mostly stable. And then you can give the command of color purple comma SSH. This H mentioned as a helix and color yellow comma SS space capital S. This capital S mentioned as a sheets and color green comma capital S S double quotations. This S mentioned as a loops and it will show the respective color which you have given. The purple color highlighted as the helix and the yellow color highlighted as the sheets and the green color highlighted as the loops. Then you can predict your active site which is involved in your enzyme activity. You predict your active site, you can give the command of select active comma open bracket resi 100 to 200 or you can give any residues and close the bracket. You can differentiate the active site using the color of blue. So give the command of color blue comma active. So the blue color mentioned the, this molecule, it is an active site. And then you give the command of zoom active. You can view clearly the active site which is presented in the specific residues of your molecule. And this blue color mentioned as the active site which is involved in the enzyme activity of your particular molecule. 
then you can predict the ligand also ligand is nothing but the small molecules you can predict the ligand molecules using the command of select ligand comma resi 150 to 200 you can give any residues like active site you will differentiate the ligand molecule using the color you can give any color but i prefer red color so i will give the command of color space red comma ligand then you can give the command of show sticks comma ligand so the ligand molecules only show in the sticks model which it is showed in the red color part of the molecules that mentioned as the ligand molecules you can rotate and see how the ligand molecule differ from the active site of the molecule then you give the command of m set space 1 space x60 uh, this command create a movie with the 60 frames then you will give the command of util dot m rock 1 comma 60 comma 180 this command rocks the protein molecule into plus 1 to minus 180 degree in a 60 frames and then you can give the command of m play this command plays the movie then you will give the command of util dot m roll 1 comma 60 this command rotate the protein molecule in a 360 degree in a 60 frames then you will give the command of m stop that the automatically the animation will be stopped then you will give the command of m png frame it will create a png file in a 60 frame you can also view the protein molecules in a 60 frames uh, to separately and clearly and the png files are created it will show the result these are all the png files which is created using this command these files are stored in your documents now go to your pc and click the documents so these are all the png frames which is created now you click it and view separately and clearly you can clearly view our active site and ligand molecules sheets helix also i am already said the object menu panel contains the active show label and colors you can use the many options then you click the ligand site and show surface so the ligand molecules only in the surface model you can rotate and view what is the difference between the cartoon and the surface model you can also add the hydrogen molecules which is presented in the cytochrome p450 enzyme you click that structure and show the hydrogen click that hydrogen add polar so the hydrogen molecules will be added on your ligand and the white color highlighted on your ligand molecule is nothing but the hydrogen which is added before and this is the overview of pymol you can also use the many option which is presented in the object menu panel like label in your atom which is presented in your molecules and add side chains also and give the different colors using the color option and you can also use the many models except than the cartoon so hello everyone you visualize the protein structure using pymol is the best other than that thank you